going to be a tarot and oracle card reading for all signs. This reading is timeless, which means it does not matter when I create or post this reading. What truly matters is when it showed up for you on your homepage or when you felt drawn to it. This is a general collective reading, so that means that you need to use your intuition to know if this reading is for you or not. This is not a personal reading, so let's get into it and find out what message Spirit wants you to know for today. Spirits, what's going on today? What would you like the person watching to know? They're wanting you to hold on to hope in this situation. The sun is going to come out with regard to this situation. Whatever it is, maybe you're losing hope. And they want you to realize there is still reason to have hope. Beautiful rainbow in the background. So maybe you've been in your feelings and your feels lately with regard to whatever is going on in this situation. But things are going to get better here. The future, the future, it looks bright for you. So have hope for the future. Things might be kind of moving slowly in this situation. With regard to this situation, the, the future looks bright. So this has to do with, with something that happened in the past. We have memories here. So that's probably why you're up in your field. You've been thinking about um, the situation. You've been thinking about the memories in this situation, but you need to have hope for the future. Something, this energy is just moving really slowly, which probably makes you feel like nothing's going to happen. But if they're here to give you a message that there's hope for the future, then obviously there is. And we have dive deep. So there's a need for you to, I feel like this is shadow work. You looking into yourself, doing some shadow work and really diving deep here or looking into the situation, doing this deep dive. Okay, what else spirits? Let's get another deck here. This is the Urban Tarot I'm gonna be using here to find out more about this message that Spirit wants you to know. What else is What's going on here? The Hierophant. Okay, what else? So I feel like we have strength here. So you need to have strength and courage to get through this situation, obviously. I mean, you're up in your feels. You're thinking about something that happened in the past. There's a need for you to, to maybe analyze that situation or analyze your inner self. Do that deep dive here. We have the Hierophant and also Princess of... Princess of Discs, so like, um, I feel like Queen of Pentacles. I don't know, this says the Kindergarten Teacher. So that coupled with the Hierophant, I feel like we're talking about some kind of a spiritual teacher. So I don't know if that's you being a spiritual teacher, because we have this Kindergarten Teacher, and also the Hierophant is basically like, Hierophant's like a pope, or if we were talking spirituality, like a spiritual teacher. The Hierophant can mean marriage, but in this case, it's like a priest. He's got his little, you know, he's a priest here. So a spiritual or religious teacher. There are, there's a moon here, so the path will be illuminated. There's things that need to come to light. So there's something you need to learn here, or, um, you know, even with this dive deep, it might be, for you to tap into a spiritual or religious teacher because there's things you need to learn.
because we have the kindergarten teacher and the hierophant, which are they're both teachers. There's an infinity symbol here with the hierophant. I mean, with the memories card, I feel like that's talking about, you know, a person, not necessarily like a career or anything like that. We're talking about a person from the past that you're sad about and you're up in the field about. But there's this need to have hope for the future, doing this deep dive into the situation or into yourself, or maybe deep dive into spirituality here to learn. But there is a need for you to have strength. But then we have the uh, 10 of discs, which would be 10 of pentacles here. And so this is like going to bring in abundance, wealth here. This card actually says wealth. So... Hmm. Tell me more about this kindergarten teacher, this hierophant. What is this about? We have three of swords. So this is heartbreak, pain, sorrow. The, the card actually says sorrow. Is that a razor blade? <laughs> it's grim. This is a bathtub. There's like blood. So maybe these memories that you're thinking about, and that's why you have to have strength because they make you really sad. I guess this hierophant and kindergarten teacher is just you learning, like seeking out like a mentor or a teacher that will help you spiritually and somehow that's gonna help you get over the sorrow, these memories of the past, and also bring you in wealth somehow. I don't know how they're connected, but apparently they are. What else, spirits? We have Prince of Discs, the Day Trader, and Queen of Wands, the Public Defender. Hmm. So somehow this might have to do with court, with this public defender, or somebody defending you, or you defending yourself. What is this day trader? Let's see. So this would be like the page of pentacles. So somebody coming in with an offer. What is this day trader spirits? The devil. Hmm. Hmm. How many more spirits? have two of pentacles which is balancing out the energy between the two but this has change so there's going to be a change in this situation clearly i think what brings in change is you learning some kind of lessons or seeking out this teacher there's with the devil that's toxic energy i feel like this person is he's a bad boy it looks like he might even be in some kind of a prison here. So I feel like we have the public defender and the devil here. He's in the he's in prison. So there's somebody here that I feel like goes to court. So maybe the person you're dealing with. you have these memories with that they're telling you to have hope for the future and have strength to get through the situation. Maybe they went to prison and this caused you great sorrow or there's some a bad boy that 
bad boy or girl that gets in trouble with the with the law. It might be because um, they did something. It actually, you know, might even be kind of a what would you call like a white collar crime or something. But this day trader, I feel like maybe they were somebody who. Um, did a crime that was like, you know, just fraudulent. So more of a, a money crime. Cause we also had wealth. So I feel like I thought that was wealth coming in for you, you going into a new cycle and it could be, I mean, maybe this is going out to somebody who, um, who actually is being accused of a crime and this is causing you great sorrow. Either that could be you or that could be somebody you're dealing with. And there's this need to get, like do a deep dive within yourself. Get a priest, get a teacher, a spiritual teacher. And that's gonna bring change. I think it's gonna bring change about in this person. So maybe this person you were dealing with, this person you're having memories about was somebody who, you know, was influenced by, by the devil here, was influenced by easy money, wanting to get this easy money, this wealth here. And so they committed a crime and, you know, maybe they're facing prison or they went off to prison, had to get this public defender here and it's created the sorrow for you. Now, I don't know if that was a parent or a lover. But there's going to be change in this situation. It's like they're working out in this in this card. So it's like this person's going to be working on themselves. They're doing a deep dive into themselves to figure out what, and then maybe they're consulting priests or teachers, they're learning. Hmm. Let's get more. I'm sorry if this one's a little slower paced. Um, that happens when I use a deck that I don't know very well because I don't have like predetermined definitions. So I have to really look at the cards Try to figure out what they're saying here. Uh, works, work. So this is like three of pentacles. So I feel like, yeah, I feel like this person will be working on themselves, but this is also, I think, a crime that could have happened because of what they do for work. Like I said, it has day trader here. So insurance fraud or like money laundering or something like that. Some kind of like white collar crime. But they're they're gonna be working on themselves like spiritually, getting, you know, a mentor or a teacher, or maybe they become a teacher because of what they've learned and how they've changed. To get how it resonates with you, and let me know down below in the comment section if this happens to resonate with you. This is not gonna resonate with a lot of people. So only let me know if it resonates with you. So we have four of cups, which is, we have, it says luxury. But there's milk here, milk and cookies. One of the cups is, is spilt. So yeah, this person wanted to live in luxury. So this could be you. I mean, it could be you, it could be them. Take it if it, if it resonates. But they wanted to live in luxury, so they pulled off this crime. Now they're facing jail time or prison time, or they already are in prison. And this is this created great sorrow for you, whether this is you or them. But spirit does want you to have hope for the future. There is this need to take a deep dive within yourself, or for them to take a deep dive within themselves, have strength, have courage get spiritual advice or wisdom or be that spiritual advice or wisdom to somebody. So this definitely has to do with this person wanting wealth. That, that Ten of Pentacles could actually be you getting wealth from this situation. Yeah, 
we have pleasure here, six of cups. Okay, so this is, I feel like this, this person that did this crime is somebody from, whoever this is for is past. This person might be different race. You know, there might be something diff very different about you guys, different religion, but, but I feel like this is somebody who you have a really, really close bond with. Maybe you had a super commitment. This could be somebody you were married to. There's wedding rings here. So six of cups is something, somebody coming back from the past. So this person from the past, this person you're maybe thinking about, There is hope for the future. This person's gonna change. This person's gonna work on themselves. <laughs> wow, okay, so you guys are also gonna be engaged in a very pleasure, pleasurable experience here. You guys are gonna have some lovemaking coming. This person's coming back from the past. You know, maybe they were trying to make this luxury for you. This wealth for you. But whatever they did that was kind of like a white, I don't, I think it's more like a white collar crime. They were trying to make money. And they might have done something that was a bit of a crime. It wasn't, you know, like murdering somebody or something like that. It was more like a money crime, having to do with money, trying to get money. They were trying to work hard on their pinnacles, but they did, they went about it the wrong way. And so they're facing jail time or they went to jail and this makes you really, really sad. So there's this need for you or this person. I think it's really this person to do a deep dive. Like they're doing the deep dive, like they're going in hermit mode and they're gonna work on themselves. And maybe, you know, with the Hierophant, maybe they're gonna have a spiritual awakening or some kind of spiritual advice with the moon, things being, needing to be revealed. So, you know, having a teacher or being a teacher because of what they've learned spiritually. We have the mage here. So this is, you know, magician energy. So I feel like you might be manifesting a change in this person, whoever this is for. There's an infinity symbol here as well. There's an infinity symbol on the Hierophant too. And on the strength card. So there's a lot of infinity symbol here. So this might be a twin flame. This might be a twin flame situation. And like I said, this is this probably won't be for a lot of people. But there's gonna be somebody out there that goes, yes, oh my God, you know, this is yeah, this is my situation. So let me know in the comments if, especially if this is for you, you've got to let me know. Again, we've got somebody facing, you know, needing somebody going to jail or facing jail, needing a public defender. And it's having to do with some kind of money crime, probably not murder or anything violent, just something like money-wise, something maybe at work, them just kind of doing something that was not, not legal at work, whether that's selling drugs <laughs> or, you know, a stockbroker who committed, you know, some kind of crime. We have the day trader here or insurance fraud or something that was like some kind of crime because they wanted this luxury. They wanted this money, this wealth, maybe for you, I don't know, but they're gonna change. They're definitely changing. So that's why you need to have hope for the future. You're thinking about this person. You need to have strength. I think they're the ones that do the deep dive here. Let me use a different deck. Wow, that's crazy. They're the ones that do a deep dive. And I think I think that they have a spiritual awakening with the Hierophant, they become very spiritual and they maybe even become a teacher to teach people, you know, look, I did wrong. This is what happened to me. Maybe even spiritual knowledge. And I think this person's coming back, whether they, you know, maybe getting out or something like that, but you're manifesting this with the mage. So maybe you are missing this person and wishing they would change and manifesting that. You're manifesting them changing and coming back to you. Wow. So I do think this is a possibility. This is a, a twin flame situation with all the infinity symbols, but we'll see 
what other cards come out. Wow, okay, so there you go. That's this reading. So I'm gonna go into an extended reading. So if this does resonate with you, and you happen to wanna watch the rest of it, um, these very particular things, if it doesn't res if that doesn't resonate with you, then it could be that there's other parts of the situation that are for you. Like just you having needing to have hope, thinking about somebody, somebody needing to do a deep dive, um, maybe doing something that wasn't on the up and up that sent them, you know, made you guys be apart, but that this person's gonna change. So you can take like the bigger picture of it. But if it does resonate with you, like those little details, then that's definitely Spirit's little wink to you that like this is for you, definitely for you. But if it's, you know, if those end of if those details don't don't resonate, but you felt drawn to the reading, then maybe the bigger picture that this person's changing, that they're coming back from the past. Um, so take the reading how it resonates with you. Or if there's something that I've said and it resonates with you different than what I'm saying, you know, definitely that's your intuition telling you that's for you. So take that. But if you want to watch the extended reading, I'm going to go to, to do that now. Go down below to the description box and click on the link that takes you over to my Patreon. Before I get into that, let me ask you to please like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Definitely subscribe and hit the notification bell to be notified when I put out these videos so that you don't miss any good details. Um, usually they're they're kind of more general, so they, they're more for a lot of people. This one was very specific, so like I said, only take it if it resonates. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know if you feel like it's for you or not. Um, if so, what the hell is going on? Is this your twin flame? Are you a twin flame? I, I really like to know all those things. Um, but yeah, if you want to watch the um, extended, go down below, click the link that takes you to my Patreon. It's only $5.55 to sign up. And you don't just get access to this one extended reading. You actually get ac exclusive access to all the bonus readings that I've done up until this point and all the readings that I do going forward for whatever time period you pay for. So it's a lot of information, a whole lot of videos. I can't even count how many videos I've done so far. Tons of videos. Um, I've been doing, you know, what, like two every day for a while now. Um, all, one that's all signs and then one that's a specific sign, whatever the sign of the day is basically. Um, so this one was all signed. So we're going to go into the bonus extended now. If you want to watch it, go over to the Patreon, sign up, and you'll have instant access to watch the rest of this and any other of the bonus extended readings that I have done. So if you want a personal reading, you can get it on my website, www.bossasswitch1111.com. I will see you in the extended for this. Bless you.